Hello and welcome to a new EasyDigitals.com video tutorial. Remember, you can get all of our high quality Photoshop and Photoshop Elements templates at EasyDigitals.com. Just click on the Products button. And don't forget to sign up for our monthly newsletter. We give away free templates and tutorials each and every month, along with product update info and coupons. Okay, Kim, what easy tutorial are you going to show us today? My last video I showed you my post-processing procedures and in this one I just want to show you another plugin that I think is really fun which is called Topaz Adjust. I'm going to flatten this and I'm going to flatten this image. I went to layer and then flatten image at the bottom and then I'm going to go ahead and make a copy and as you go along I would go ahead and save this because this program um, tends to uh, crash a lot, the Topaz Adjust. So I'm going to go ahead and pull up my filter and then come down to Topaz Adjust and then Topaz 3. And it basically comes up and it shows you on the left here all these different options. And it kind of gives you um, a more intensified look. And I, I tend to like this one here. So I'm going to go ahead and click on that one and click OK. And sometimes it does add a little bit of extra noise. So I go ahead and run a noise filter on it. And click OK. And sometimes this just gives some extra fun dimension to your photos. I have another one here that, that I really like it on. OK, so I've pulled up another photo and I just want to show you how it looks with this one. And this one I think has a lot of fun options that look really nice. Again, I tend to like um, small details. I, with the shininess of the jersey, it just really adds some nice touches to it. They're psychedelic. Let's go ahead and try that one. So we come over here and click OK. And then maybe it looks like it has a little bit too much noise, so we go filter, noise wear. And this one I'm going to go ahead and do portrait because I want it to remove a lot of noise. Click OK. And if you want to, you can just keep running that over until you get rid of some of that noise, but it still adds that dimension to it that looks really cool. It's just kind of a fun technique you can use with your photos. So enjoy. Hey, that was easy. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions about this tutorial or any of our products, you can always reach us at easydigitals.com. Have yourself a creative day.